Hey, sixth graders, I know it's probably weird to see me like this, but this is Mr. Chrisman coming to you live from Star Production Studios. I know I've talked with you, a couple of you, about the fact that I do podcasting, but here I am in my production studio talking to you about what you can be doing during this time shut-in uh, for sixth grade music. So believe it or not, there are things that you can still be doing that can be working towards your stuff and well, it gives you something to do and some kind of fun stuff to learn about. So I just thought I'd kind of take a second and walk you through that today. And yes, my studio has multiple cameras high so I can come actually look at people from multiple angles. So I usually have three guys in the studio. This is really weird to have just one of me to be talking to you guys. I'm so used to like this studio being full, all three sides of the table. You usually have people at it more. So it's kind of odd for me to be talking to you like this is one person. So let me throw you into my screen here and show you what you can do while you are at home. First off, if you weren't aware, I have been keeping up with squilts. So I actually have been putting more squilts on. So please don't be afraid to go there and do squilts. The list of songs is still there. So you can click on your Google Docs document, find your list of songs, find the song you need to go look up. Now, the cool thing I've been doing lately about the squilts is if you click on a squilt, I'll be today, so the 20th, uh, 25th squilt, not only can you fill out the form, but I also put the YouTube video link so you don't have to try to go find it. It's right there on your page right next to your squilt. So I did that for all your squilts. I will say this, I decided to suspend the music theory section, so there will not be any new additions there. Um, I might change my mind about that later, depending on what I think you can handle and what I don't think you can handle. A lot of it has to do with the fact that I'm worried about the drawing ability, and I don't know what you guys have at home, whether you've got pads, iPads, Chromebooks, or whatever it is. On the keyboard section, pay attention in the next week or so. I'm going to be adding some YouTube videos in. Uh, it's probably not going to be me because I want to find other videos out there. I think they're there. I just have to search and find them on how to play scales on keyboard without, you know, Mr. C's help too much in case you have a keyboard at home or piano and you want to practice that. Uh, if not, if you've got a tablet, uh, there are such things as virtual keyboards. You might have to look for those online. Your music history, I'm going to keep adding to that just because I think there's a lot there you could learn about without Mr. C's help. You don't need me to go through these. For example, I added workbook page 23 and 24. And just like before, on any of these, you can actually open those PDFs uh, you click on your three dots, it'll give you a new tab on your page, and then you can open with Doc Hub and sign in with your school account, and you should be able to get into those pages as well. So it should be able to load up her pretty much right away. And you can do just like you've been doing, you can type your answers in, and if you get stuck on any of these, let me know. Uh, don't forget when you get done, okay, when you're done with these, you have to go back and click on View Assignment. And in your upper right-hand corner, it'll ask you to attach an attachment. So you attach your attachment, click Turn In twice, and then you can turn that information into me. Uh, so Squilts, definitely keep up with music history, keep up with. That'll keep happening. Exit tickets. For right now, you can ignore these. They're not important. I'm not really focusing on them. It's okay. Kind of limited with some of the stuff we can do. The Voice Season 17. I'm actually going to try. <laughs> I'm going to try to upload the voice videos for you guys, because I know some of you really were enjoying that project. I was actually enjoying doing it with you. So I'm going to see if I can get the videos on there. If I can, very soon, you're going to start seeing season 17 of the voice popping up as videos. So when you go to click on this, I might have like night one, night two, night three of the audition videos in there, and you can watch those and fill in your sheets and turn your sheets in as well for that. So basically, the only things you really can ignore at this point is your exit tickets. Don't worry about those. Don't worry about your music theory. Keep looking for that keyboard section. Keep looking for the music history pages. It'll keep happening. And every once in a while, I'm going to try to give you guys a video uh, to let you know how Mr. C is doing uh, and what's going on in my wonderful life, because I know that you're probably like me, and you're shut in, and you're doing your social distancing, and I'm sure that you would like something to do instead of just sitting around watching TV all day long. So I'm trying to give you guys some things to do. If you have any questions, please feel free to go to the Google Classroom and put it right there in the stream on the front page. Um, or if you have other questions, you can email me at my school email address. It's C-R-I-S-S-M-A-R at BinghamtonSchools.org. Uh, send me any questions you have. I don't mind answering them. And with that said, I'll be checking back in with you guys at some point via video. If you have other questions, throw it on the Google Classroom. If you're having issues with things, let me know, uh, and I'll find some answers for you and get it to you guys. Uh, different times, different places, but you know what? We're still learning music. 
and that's the most important thing. And I hope you guys are at least trying to keep up with Mr. C and all the crazy things he's doing for you. So, hope to see you kitties soon. Uh, 14th of April cannot come soon enough for me, and I can't wait to see you guys again. Have a good one, Till I talk to you later.